Hey guys, this is Aaron with the Rivers of Provision. I just want to kind of give you an inside look at what our filtration system is here at our aquaponics facility. Um, it's very modest. We uh, use a 60-gallon uh, conical filter um, to uh, filter out our sludge from the bottom of the pool, the fish waste, and you can see right here, this is where we'll drain it out of. And the way it works is we have a line coming in from the pool goes all the way to the bottom and then shoots out at a 90 degree angle. Okay, that 90 degree angle creates a swirl motion around the bottom and uh, basically what that swirl motion does is it centralizes all the waste into the into the center bottom of this barrel <clears throat> so that when we go to uh, drain our fertilizer out we have uh, we get all of it. Okay, so as you can see we have some uh, some hardware cl hardware cloth right here this black stuff and what that does is you also see two white bars those uh, support our filter floss filters we use three of them and we change those or we clean them once or twice a week and uh, that's what I'm in the process of doing now so I figured I'd take the opportunity to show you guys what we're doing so um, I've got those sprayed out now this, they, everything flows out of the top here. You see we got the intake that goes in at the bottom, the outflow that goes up at the top to minimize the waste that goes into the next step in our uh, filtration, which is our moving bed reactor. And I'm just going to get this so that it'll, that it'll uh, fire up again. Take just a second. And what, now what we have in here are... K1 Caldness Media. As you can see, it's all brown on the inside from our uh, our good bacteria that uh, turns our fish waste from ammonia to nitrites to nitrates, which is nitrogen, which is what feeds our plants. You can see on the outside, there's no bacteria. Okay, and that's caused by the agitation of the air that we are pumping in through this airline right here. Okay, the purpose of that that makes this whole thing. Uh, self-cleaning that means we never have to uh, clean it out don't have to open it if we don't need to and as you, as you can see I've kind of made a flip top on that barrel there with just a couple of cheap cabinet hinges there it's quite handy and I even used a couple of the caldness media to cover the heads of the screws but anyway um, that's pretty much it uh, water flows out of there and into this gravel bed which I was was our original design for uh, for a uh, biological filtration but it just got clogged up with waste so we decided to do the the uh, filter pads instead and works much much better so don't have to worry about it clogging up or anything like that as you can see our typical uh, uh, Tampa summer has <laughs> pretty much killed these few little squash plants that I was trying to grow just to see what would happen but it's just too, too hot. So, till next time, be blessed.